Hey everybody, this is Rido, and we are back with another recording of LEGO Star Wars The Complete Saga. We are doing Chapter 6 of Episode 5, Betrayal Over Bespin. We need just 6 minifig kits, which... I say just 6, but that is actually quite a lot. Yeah. But... Probably won't take too much to find them all. There's that one there. I don't think there's one there. There we go. Pull this. Let's see, where are they? There's one in this room, obviously. So he's out of the way. Django Fett versus Django. No, this is Boba Fett versus Boba Fett. Gotta be careful about that self destruct button. There we go, that destroys that. And there's one down. Come over here. Find our R2-D2 unit. Another one. Half of these we knew were in the game and where they were. We just simply could not reach them. Uh, there you go. You want to... I can't reach it that way, apparently. My partner doesn't want to cooperate. So instead I'll hover over to the other side, change over the jar jar, see if that works. No, that's too tall! I gotta convince my guy to cooperate with me. Hold that down. Hold that down. Maybe we can clear some guys out of this area. Ah, now you he will cooperate now that the guys are gone. That almost was a problem. Over here? Anything over here? Hmm. Let's open this one. Working our way through this curvy, bendy thing. The curving of the levels is cool. It does certainly add an effect makes things feel more architecturally designed, but it wreaks havoc on the arrows when they're pointing here. Open that. Up we go. Get over there that, like that. Can I get over here like this? Yes, I can. Now this one's just magnetic though, so it's not gonna work to pick up those bad guys. This one up there. I believe I can reach. Where is it? Where'd it go? Ah. Uh, Jar Jar. There we go. Did 
down this way. How many more do I have? Two. And I see two. That poor guy is stuck in the death loop and we're gonna just have to hear him die. Non-stop. Where is it? Must be behind this door. I've never been behind this door? What's back here? Not a lot. Just the conference room. Which I think we saw this conference room in the movie. In the cutscene. And the last one is... This gas is killing me. It kills Boba Fett too. Do you think Boba Fett and these troopers would have some kind of mask in their armor that would point to that would purify the air? Okay, so it's on top of the ship. We can deal with that. to run back and raise the bridge. Silly me. Silly me. Was so happy to see the... Was so happy to see the things work. Let's see. Oh, turn that on. Stand here. Multi-action so lower gate. I think as long as you stay within the realm of just having two things you have to do to lower gate, you're fine. But if I had to do three things in a specific order, you you would it would be a little difficult of, for kids. Uh, even if you wrote pictorial instructions as to what was supposed to be done to lower the gate. I don't think that would be enough for some kids. Still stuck at four billion. <laughs> Man, if I only had a penny for every one, I'd be a four billionaire. Heck, if I only had a penny for every thousand of them, I'd still be happy. If I had a penny for every million of them, I'd be happy. So, we're working towards that maximum gold brick collection. 121 gold bricks done. It's kind of true that this game ends kind of on a whimper now that I think about it. It's just kind of has to there's we're going to get every single gold brick we're gonna do everything that can possibly be done and much like the endings once you've just completely done everything in most games there's simply just nothing more to do was this always in this was this room always like that I don't know So a lot of curvy places where blue canisters could be hidden. We have 20 minutes. I want to get this guy out just in case there is another blue canister where that mini kit piece was. 
but I seriously doubt that will be the case. Stop hitting me! It might have been wiser if they had put challenge mode above the free play mode. That might have been a little bit uh, of a nicer way to play. Since challenge mode is so similar to story mode, this, that kind of makes sense. Uh, is there a blue canister up here? No. Nope. Doesn't seem like there is. Beat him to his ship. Interesting. So that's five, that seems about the right number. Roll down this hallway. Open this doorway. Hmm. Blue canisters, where are you? Hmm. <clears throat> Any blue canisters this way? No. How about over here as this guy? There's quite a lot of guys here, here. Let's see if we can solve that problem. Any blue canisters in this area? No. Open this. No, I didn't want to do that. Here we go. No blue canisters this way. Force our way upwards. Charge our binks is needed for that jump. Looks like there's one up there. Yeah, that wasn't ever gonna make that. Let's see where. Well, Take him this way, and where's Boba Fett? Boba Fett is there. Is seven the right number for him? as far as we've gotten? Yeah, it seems like it could be the right number. I could have stayed in droid form and they wouldn't have attacked me, but then I would have had to walk through that entire ha hallway very slowly. There's one up there. Um, means I need to do this and do this. That's eight. We might as well check and make sure there isn't another one somewhere hidden over here. Dark side user. No blue canisters in here. I need a robot. Here is a robot. Hmm. 
there's one. And the last one is over there, so we just need the the bridge up. And we can go. up and we are good to go. Why are they shooting on their own droid friends? I mean, not droid friends, but stormtrooper friends. You know, there's too much, uh, too many buzzwords in this game. I've come to, I've just realized that. As far as, not, not particularly in this game, as much as in the Star Wars universe. Too many buzzwords. Too many unfamiliar concepts of things. It, Star Wars is the ultimate example, example of lore creep. Where for no real reason, instead of calling them just troopers, they call them stormtroopers. Uh, in fact, a lot of the shots and a lot of the story from s these original Star Wars movies were taken directly from war movies. So, that, it's no real surprise, but then you would... I mean, Vespin Gas, Bespain, Jabba the Hutt, all of that stuff is just more and more lore creep until you have an entire universe and I guess that's how you make a universe and it worked out this time uh, par partially because he made the uh, movies over three parts and then he made the original movies so three more parts so six parts now and we're about to be the seventh movie to explore expand the universe even more if a video game had tried to say as much as Star Wars did, it would be really confusing and and very squashed full of dialogue and stuff. Well, we are done with episode 5 and it says we've been playing for 29 hours and I'm willing to kind of believe it. I'm, I'm, I'm not even going to shave a couple hours off there. It feels like I've been playing for 29 hours. We're at 86.9% done. And we have just a few more things that we need to do. So there's nine gold bricks left in Return of the Jedi. And after those nine gold bricks, we're going to have to get the rest through doing Super Story Mode, which will be six really long episodes in which I just run through it. And then we... Uh, need to uh, uh, do all of the what are they bounty hunter missions in fact w we're going to do that the opposite way though we're going to do the bounty hunt missions and then do the super story mode so super story mode will be the last six episodes unless something else happens of this series and we will just run through the story once again. But we will start all of that next time because we are done with this time. As always, I ask you to like, share, subscribe, comment if you want to, and watch every second of my videos. All of that helps me with YouTube. If you want to support me, you can click on my name, Rido. On the right will be a blue button that says support this channel. Click it and make a donation. And if you want to friend or follow me on basically any social media sites, there's a whole bunch of links down below. Thank you for watching. Have a good evening.